All okay, right. so we're going to jump to this week's challenge, and this week's challenge was a blast from the past, from those good old days. So let me throw up that screen share to throw up that PowerPoint. Stop saying throw up on air. kind of sounds weird. Let's, let's show it right, right now. Okay, so last week I said that there was an Easter egg in um, Excel and one of the versions of Excel, and for those who, who remember this Easter egg, it created a flight simulator, and you could fly around, and then you could go see the credits. So I asked you, what version of Excel? And you responded, Excel 97. And if you did respond that, you were correct. And there we have Clippy, who was our good old friend from Excel 97, <laughs> one, of, one of the great characters Microsoft created to make our lives easier. So who was this week's winner? Well, this week's winner was Jim Birch. Congratulations, Jim. You win a model off entry for free. Good job. And Clippy, Clippy, thank you. Yes. <laughs> what, what's that, Clippy? Our, <laughs> I think he thinks that you're writing a resume and wants to know if you need help. All right, so we're going to talk about next week's challenge. As of Excel 2013, what is the longest formula function? I can guarantee you I've never used this function. Now, uh, some people have, and maybe if you are a person who likes long functions, you know which one it is, but I had to look this one up. So, that is what we're looking for. Now, remember, if you know uh, the answer to this week's challenge, you can tweet us at Excel TV, you can go on our Facebook, or you can send us an email, challenge at ExcelTVShow.com, or um, you can also send a letter to our good friend Carl Pepperseed, and he will... Uh, recite the answer as a story. So, that is our challenge. Back to you, Rick. Thank you, Jordan. Uh, yeah, Carl Pepperseed, given the, given the, the answer every week, that would be, uh, that'd be epic. <laughs> 